One of the big challenges when winter storms hit here in Tennessee is drivers trying to get around in ice and snow. It is difficult, for, I, I feel like, for the, uh, the ones here that's not used to driving in snow because uh, we get a lot of calls where, you know, they uh, run off the road and they need to go and stuff like that. Johnny Weddle is the superintendent of Jackson Street Department. Even he was surprised by the amount of snow we got. We really didn't expect this this morning. Weddle says his street department does have a strategy when winter storms hit. We always try to get our main roads like North Island, North Road, Van Drive. We try to get those roads, get those roads first. But driving isn't the only issue. Down the road in Memphis, many are without power and are coming here to Jackson for help. Generators still. We're having people from Memphis uh, that are coming in to get generators because uh, you know, they're all still without power. I guess Memphis is sold out. Blake White owns the Ace Hardware store in Jackson. He says when power goes out, people try other ways to keep warm. Get heaters, you know, a lot of people are buying heaters now, propane heaters. Obviously, if the power goes out, the regular heaters won't work, so uh, a lot of propane heaters and gas heaters. White also advises homeowners to wrap exposed water pipes to prevent them from freezing. But both he and the Jackson Street Department superintendent agree that the best cure for the winter storm blues would be some warmer temperatures. For 39 News, I'm Alexander Bitterling in Jackson.